All right, so today I'm gonna to show you how to install a sling on an 1886 LaBelle long rifle. This is my Tool 1886 or 1888 dated LaBelle rifle. And the reason I'm making this short video is because I myself couldn't find any online video instructions on how to put this on when I ordered it, so here we are. Um, this reproduction was called the 1890 slash 92, 1915, rifle sling offered uh, for sale from Man the Line. Um, just as a quick note, I couldn't really find anything on the history of French rifle slings or even if this is a correct designation. It seems like it's just a super generic copy of a LaBelle Berthier sling you'll see on like stock images online, but it works for my purposes to dress up the rifle a bit and make it look a little bit nicer, I think. Um, the one thing I did find was that the pre-World War I French slings were black, while ones manufactured from 1915 onwards were brown or, I guess, like fawn-colored to save money in production costs. So, just about as much history as I know from these. Um, anyway, let's go ahead and put this thing on. Alright, and like I said, I think this can pretty much be interchangeable with other French rifles like a Berthier or a Moss 36, um, or I don't know if it goes back to Grasse, um, the Grasses, just not, not entirely sure, but anyway, just to dress up the rifle a little bit, but it comes in a coil like this, we're going to go ahead and just uncoil it, we'll take the end here, as so, and we'll put it in the rear swing, swivel swing, sorry, and... We'll just get the rest of this out. There's gonna be this little black piece here and we're just going to bring this all the way around. We'll take this end piece here, put it through this piece and that's what's gonna hold your, uh, that's what's gonna hold it in the back. And then we're gonna take this piece here again and we're just going to slide it through this buckle like so. And then to give it a little bit more slack, we'll just go ahead and loosen this up. As you can see, it's a nice tight buckle. Let's work our way around. It's pretty simple, um, but again, the reason I'm making this is just because I couldn't find any, any sources online on how to do this. So. Um, here we are doing that and showing you guys how to put together this, this, uh, shoulder strap. And then take the end piece like we had here and we'll just put it through the front swivel swing. And then it also came with this little brass piece. Again, this is just, um, I took it out beforehand just to make it easier. We'll go ahead and just fit it in and then fit because of the new uh because it's a reproduction leather it's going to be pretty hard to stretch but let's get in there the best we can and uh yeah you just heard the bolt come down on that these labels i love these old rifles um especially these french ones are just becoming harder to find they're just kind of like gems out there you just they're not really available on the market as much as you'd like we're almost there, guys. Cool. Well, we got this um, in. And so this is what your uh, rifle sling is gonna look like for the French LaBelle. In the front there, and then we also have the rear here. And again, you can, it's pretty easy to adjust to make it tighter or looser on the back or front end, but yeah. And there you have it, there is the LaBelle uh, rifle sling.